of the East. Jack Burford Chevrolet presents Race Week at the Richmond Raceway in Richmond, Kentucky. Here's your host in all things racing, Bill Lupino. Hey everybody, welcome to this week's Race Week. Jack Burford Chevrolet at the Richmond Raceway. Bill, tell us all about it. We got a big race coming up. We do. For we'll sure. start with a quick recap of yep. this past absolutely. Saturday night. Absolutely. Um, we ran our second annual Liney Centers Memorial featuring the American Racer South Super Stock Series, and it okay. was our first season running that series. This was the championship weekend. Okay, so that was the first yep. one. Okay, yep. cool. Um, it was championship weekend, double points, came okay. into it with the whole top five, had the mathematical way that they could mm -hmm. win the title mm -hmm. if this happened and that happened and this happened. Sure. And oddly enough, this was happening and that was happening and this was happening, and we our point it, leader had issues and second place had right, issues. Right. Ended up being the gentleman that went into it fourth in points that okay. needed this one to finish 18th or worse and this one to finish seventh or worse. Won the race, Glenn okay, Hanshaw Jr. Good, good. He won the race, I pending saw, tire yep, tests, yep, which nice. we're you know we're sending out tire samples here today because we're filming Monday. So yep, absolutely. Always got to say that. Um, sending out tire tests today it takes about a week, eight ten days to get okay. it back, and if that comes back clean, which you know we hope it does and assume it will, um, okay. he'll be not only the winner of the race, but he also would be the series champion. Oh, nice. Uh, which, tell us about the tire. Tell us about the tire thing. A lot of people, first time, right? They, what, what is that? Yeah, we tire, tire test uh, first place in all the Super Stock Series races, okay. first and second for the 5,000 win okay. line centers. We also tire test the winner of all the Ultimate Heart of America races. Uh, we just take a little tread of tire off, um, put it in the vial. It's sealed up, put in an evidence bag, sealed up. They sign off that they witness all of this okay. stuff. Send it out to Blue Ridge Labs over there in North Carolina. Right. Kim Johnson does a really good job, okay. and she tests to make sure it meets the benchmark. There's no chemicals added. There's Got no okay, good. screwy stuff going on. Right, you know, right. We have had issues in the past, but you know, right. I know she's busy. She does it for everyone. She sure. does stuff for NASCAR. So sure. okay. we get it out to her first thing Monday. She usually has it by Wednesday, Thursday. But we get the results. Sure. We haven't and gotten them back a, yet from last week, from but last we're still week. waiting. And that's but, a little thing I don't think a lot of people realize. No, you got to. a little, after yeah. the race, you got to do a tire test. Yeah, I mean, you got to keep, yeah, keep people honest. Yeah, Keep people honest. But, right. yep, so as long as everything comes back good, you know, okay. Glenn cool. won the race. He'll be the series champion. The series Excellent. champion gets paid $2,000. Nice. Uh, second Excellent. was a thousand. Third is five hundred. Once we have all the official results, we'll put it out there, and we know who's what and, and all that. And cool. You know, then we ran our um, chapter one really group pro late models. Right. And Brad Rickles, who's a Florence regular, but they weren't running crates. He came down here, comes, runs with us a few times a year. He won his first ever race at Richmond. He was very, Good. very happy. Excellent. And then Zach Powers, who's our yeah. current point leader for the Eagle Finance UMP Modifieds, got his first win of the season. He finished his second like every week. He okay. Got his first win. Got of his season. first one. Good. Yep. So Excellent. you know, so he won the modifieds. So you know, we'll put that weekend to bed and we'll get ready for this weekend. Absolutely. Speaking of this weekend, and of course you can always <clears throat> find the race results, pictures, and all that great information yes. on the website, RichmondRaceway.net. Yep. Uh, this weekend. Yes, this the weekend, the big race. Rescheduled. 34th annual Paul Butterwall yes, Woolridge absolutely. Memorial. Um, it was rescheduled because when it was supposed to run back in August, I had that thing going around and yep, that little thing. It was kind of we'll, down and we'll, out for we'll a few weeks, so right. we had to postpone the race. Sure. Um, but we are running it as long as Mother Nature allows this weekend. This weekend, right. Two-day show. Um, yeah, tell us it's two days, yes, Friday and Saturday. Yes, it's two days, and I know day. that you know there are some people that complain that it should only be one day, but there mm -hmm. is a reason for the two-day sure. with our very, very, very firm curfew. Yes. And the yes. fact that you usually end up running the four heat races for the Supers, a B main or two, mm -hmm. and I've had people tell me we should cut the support classes, and I'm not going to do that because mm -hmm. Butterball is big to everyone in this area. It is. It and, is. And, you know, Truly if you're is. a modified guy, a super set guy, a crate guy that's run with us all year, you want to be part of that right. event. So we don't want to cut you. Sure. We want to run everyone because they support it all year. Let Absolutely. them run the biggest show. You know, yeah. we raise their purses as well, you know, the winner's pay and yeah. all that type of thing. So Friday night. Okay. Butterball preliminary night. It's preliminary. What time yes. does that start? Um, we're actually starting a little later. We're going to okay. start at 7 because it's seven. Friday night and okay. people work. Um, sure. We're going to open the front gate at 5. Okay. Um, roll out hot laps at 7. It's adults 15, 12 and under free. Okay. Are the prices up there for that? Right. Um, and you have concessions and everything. Oh, yeah. Right? Everything will be just open. Like, just like normal night racing. Right. Absolutely. Gotcha. Concessions okay. will be open. Everything right. will be ready to go. Hot laps and qualifying for the Ultimate Heart of America Super okay. Late Models. Okay. Heat races. Three or four. It's been four the last couple of years. We're hoping it'll be four again because that means you have the good cars. Sure. We also include an open practice for any and other 
class that wants nice. to come out. And Excellent. even if we don't run you, you want to bring a sprint car out and turn laps, sure. come on out. Come on out. And then at the end of the session, we do an, an hour of open practice for everyone, including the supers, because they cool. can't go out and practice earlier because they're doing cool. their other thing. Right, right. The last couple of years we've done that, the super late models are packing the track for that last hour, and the right. guys really appreciate it. They've said it gives them more of an idea of track conditions with the temperatures oh, and all that for the yeah. next night. Yeah, when so the race it should is. be the same. Yeah. Yep. Right. So, you know, we, we roll out that hour of open practice for everyone there, okay. and then cool. kick everybody out, basically, and nice. get to work. You know, you got to get the track get back ready in shape. For and, the big race you know, on clean Saturday. up everything and get yep. ready to go. And then Saturday, we'll roll out with our normal times. Okay. Uh, open the pit gate at 2, the grandstand at 4. Um, a lot of people do camp. You know, the late model guys will stay in the pit, and they, right. you know, they'll camp in there. We, the fields fill up with campers and all that. So Absolutely. it's really it's, it's a busy day. It's a great atmosphere. It is. It is. It really is. Especially but, for the butterball, uh, the, the yep. ones I remember. So so then we'll uh, – oh, also those heat races Friday night. Yes. I forgot to mention this. They sure. pay $1,059 to win. Oh, they pay. They pay. Just the winner. <laughs> it's $1,059 to win the heat That's races. pretty cool. Yes. And then right. Saturday – Regular times, you know, pick right. eight to two, grandstand at four, rolling off hot laps at six. That will feature the B mains, the last chance qualifiers for the super late models, one or okay. two. Okay. And then full programs of racing for the Eagle Finance UMP Modifieds, Chapter mm -hmm. One really group, really two group pro late models, okay. and the AR bodies, KDR AR super stocks. Paying twelve fifty nine to win the crates nice. and pro late models and the mods. Normally it's a thousand, so they're up. Two hundred fifty nine dollars. Okay, and cool. we're paying the super socks eight fifty nine. Normally they're seven fifty, so they're bumped so up they're as bumped well. They're bumped up too. Cool. And which, like I said, that's why we don't want to cut support classes. Exactly. People all tell right. us that we should. A little but, reward there. You know, we don't want to go over curfew. Um, you know, right. Judge Taylor's been great to us the last couple seasons, and right. we've worked right. really well with the county and everybody. Sure. And we don't want to get silly. Absolutely. And, you know, we're going to push this all in one night and go till three o'clock in the morning yeah, and yeah, make like, everyone mm. mad. It's just not the right thing to no. do. No, no. So you know, that's what we're doing. But yep, full concession, everything will be there. Have the judge come out and ever done the the final lap race? You should. You, he yeah. should do that. I, you know, Reggie, come on, man. We mentioned it to him when we when we sat down and talked to him a couple like I think it was last year before the season right. started. My wife went and, and right. I went and sat and talked to him and sure. he's been out before. It's not a sure. thing. He's exactly not a big right. dirt racing thing and all hey, that. I'm but, gonna talk. I'm gonna talk to him. I yeah. see him quite a bit. I'm gonna say, Reagan, go out there. Come on, wave that yeah. checker flag. Come on out and on. you know do something. Have with your us. picture. Kind of fun. <laughs> That'd be but cool. um, you know we will have our full line of concessions. Cool. Snappy tomato. Pizza, sure. like we always do, you know, the plain, the pepperoni, all your nachos, popcorn, and pulled pork, uh, hot dogs, chili dogs, everything. If Frankie comes out, can you give him a couple free slices of pizza? We could, or okay. he could try that <laughs> barbecued pulled oh, pork that's that everybody really, good. really, really everybody loves. Because that's, right. that, that's really a hit. But, you know, so. cool. you know, full line of concessions, t shirt good. vendors. I, I know that some of the drivers bring their souvenir trailers right, and they right. set up so up on the midway, too. too. And, it's a really you know, nice atmosphere. It is. I mean, it's, it's, I mean, it's racing atmosphere. It is. I mean, you got the. The fumes and the yep. sounds and Absolutely. the smells of the concessions. It's fantastic. It is. And, you know, we're hoping Mother Nature is going to be our friend. The midweek here is looking a little iffy. But once you hit Friday, Saturday, it looks right. better. So as long as we can get out there and do the work and we do need the to work do, you can do and right. have the place ready to go, we will. I mean, you know, we had that practice last Friday night. Right. And my son jumped on the grader and went out there when that was done. And we were out until I think it was about 1230, quarter okay. to one, right. working on the track. Track was good. And, uh, and, and, got know, it, and got it yep, fixed. He got right. it, got it all graded up from the Friday night practice, cool. and we got cool. some water on her and did our thing. And, you know, we're going to just do the work and have it be ready to go. That's fantastic, Bill. Yep. Uh, one more time, what is it this weekend? Yes. Go ahead and go through the Friday and Saturday uh, schedule. 34th Annual Paul Butterball Wooldridge Memorial. Okay. Preliminary night Friday night. Hot laps, qualifying heat races, open practice for support classes. Gotcha. Pick gate is at 3. Grandstand at 5, hot lap scheduled for 7. For 7, okay. Saturday, B mains and the 20,059 to win feature for the Ultimate wow, Heart America Super Late Models. It is. Can you say that again? $20,059 $20, to win. Wow. My wife hates that. It's a big check to write. <laughs> but, you know. It's the 59. Yeah, that's what that was. <laughs> Put your over the And edge. then the, the full programs for right. the, uh, like I said, Eagle Finance, UMP okay. Modifieds, Chapter 1 Realty Group Pro Late Models, and cool. AR Bodies, KDRA, KDRA Super Sox. Normal times, pick gate two, grandstand four, hot lap schedule for six, and you know, we'll get get rolling with it. Hey, uh, so Bill, tell us about accommodations. Yes, uh, Quality Inn, right here in Richmond, great okay. hotel, really cool. nice place, they treat you well. Go to my website, go to the sponsor tab, find the logo for Quality Inn, click on that logo and you get a discount by booking Excellent. through, That's through the website. And we did have some people from Eastern Kentucky come right. out for the Lonnie Centers. Did. They asked practice night for a hotel, mm -hmm. My wife told them all how to do it. They went and stayed there, told us Saturday it was great, really nice hotel. I appreciated Excellent. it. So, you know, it is it is a good place to go. Excellent. So That's hopefully fantastic. people come in from out of town, you know, if they're not going to camp, they can go uh, cool. go sit quality in. Cool. Uh, also, folks, everything is on the website. 
very comprehensive website, website and, we're and the Facebook, Facebook page. Um, yeah. I have a lot of posters from mm -hmm. Ken Short 28 Designs yep, that are really absolutely. nice. We're going to be putting them out during the week. We're cool. going to do some driver cards as we get um, some drivers that are telling mm -hmm. us that they're coming, which we already do have a handful. Cool. You Good know, deal. he's going to put them on there and we'll put them out and start telling people who we have confirmed. And, Excellent. You know, we do know of some, some others that we're talking to. Sure. And, you don't ever get them all, and then sometimes right. you put someone out and something happens and they can't come. But, sure. you know, we try to let the fans know who is trying who's, to come. Who's what and yep. who's doing what. It's exactly. always an expectation, right. you know, of hoping that sure. they say they are, but you never know. You just you know, never know. That's right. Somebody, you know, you have people that are going to load their car and something breaks. Yep. So it does I happen. Know. But, it you know, so we can't guarantee the ones we put out are coming, sure. but we don't put them out till they tell us they are planning Absolutely. to. Absolutely. So, right. But we'll be putting those out all week long. Excellent. Folks, racing this Friday and Saturday. Check them out. Facebook, Twitter. They're everywhere. Race. Race this week. Absolutely. All right. Thanks, Bill, for coming in. And this Thank week's you. Jack Burford Chevrolet Race Week at the Richmond Raceway.